Hello, we're here to tell you about Colonial Connecticut. Hi, my name is Nova and I'm going to tell you about the history of Connecticut. Phil Hartford and Winsor decided to form the Connecticut Colony in April 1636. That was the same year the settlers battled and won the Pequot War, which was from 1636 to 1638. In 1639, the colony's leaders wrote the Fundamental Order. The Fundamental Order only allowed male property owners to vote for a legislature and a New England's governor, Edmund Andros, wanted to control the legislature, so he demanded each colony to give their charter to him. According to legend, Hartford's leader hid the Connecticut Charter in the oak tree to prevent Andros from taking it. That's all for Connecticut's history. Talk about um, Savvy of Geography. There is mud. We married winters. They are. There are only winters and um, summers is a New England county candies, New Hudson Musets, and Newark, and Rhode Island Musets, New Newark City, and, and Rhode Island are Eight. Ocean Opera Sauce <laughs> <laughs> and Black Cake Ocean all South okay. and the Black Cake River and Cats and Half. Thanks, Joe. I'm going to tell you about Colonial you. Connecticut's economy. Colonial Connecticut's colony was built off small farms and trade. First trade ships that left Connecticut for Barbados were loaded with produce in the, in the 1650s. Connecticut had rocky soil, plentiful forests, and easy access to the sea. So farm crops consisted of herbs, corn, and tobacco. Other jobs included fishing, lumbering, and shipbuilding. That's all for Connecticut's economy. Hi, I'm Ryan, and I'm going to tell you about Colonial Connecticut's government. Colonial Connecticut's government is a constitutional monarchy. A constitutional monarchy is a form of democratic government in which a non-political monarch acts as head of state within the boundaries of constitution. Their laws were largely based on the Bible. And that's it for the government of the Connecticut colony. I will talk about Kids in the market, they did clothes, bones, they walked to school, boys, ups, and some were 15, go to stay home because there's none. Some, their friends, their parents, their parents. Now to buy. Hi, it's me again, and this time I'm going to tell you about the Connecticut colony's religion. The settlers in the colony were mostly Puritans. Puritans believe in the Bible, education, and punishment. Now here's some fun facts. Puritans banned all music because it is a tool of the devil. Puritans wear very dull clothes, and the only thing they could do on Sunday was go to church. That doesn't sound like a whole lot of fun, but that's it for the religion of the Connecticut Con. Thanks for watching. That's all for Colonial Connecticut's Colony. Thank you guys for coming, stupid.